Hi, this is Virgo the Oracle, and I'm here to do a reading for the sign of Virgo. Hey, Virgo, how are you? Let's tap into this energy like we always do. See if it changes, see if it stays the same. Spirit come through from Virgo. Hold your ears. Come through, Spirit. Gonna have some messages for Virgo. What's the current energy around Virgo? What messages do you have for Virgo? Sun, moon, and rising. Okay, Virgo, thank you so much for all your donations, all your beautiful comments. Thank you for riding with me, okay? Let's tap into this energy and find out what's going on with Virgo. What's the current energy for Virgo? Mm -hmm. What's happening, Virgo? What's happening? Spirit come through. First position you have. Ooh, you got the tower. Okay, first position. Mm -hmm. You got the hermit coming out in your own read. You got the magician. You have the six of wands. You have the death card. You have the nine of pentacles. You have the page of wands. Okay. You have the Wheel of Fortune. Mmm, beautiful. You have the Ace of Pentacles. You have the Sun. Okay. Mm -hmm. You have the Two of Cups. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And you have the Six of Pentacles. Give me a minute. Let me look this over. All right. Okay. Very good. What's going on? Gods and goddesses, what is going on? Alright, mm hmm mm hmm Let's see what we got here. Mm-hmm, mm hmm Alright, you have one, two, three, four, five, six major arcanas. We will definitely take them, okay? Is that about right? One, two, three, four, five, six. Yep, six major arcanas. We will definitely take them. All right, and at the bottom of the deck, you have the Knight of Pentacles, Virgo. Virgo, there's someone who's really interested in you. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. They're ready to um, show that they're in, like invest in you or something like that, or show more interest in you. They're coming up at night. Okay, this person might take a long time. They might take forever to make a move or to pursue you. But this is somebody like you can trust or you do trust this person. This is like a trustworthy energy. Okay, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. King of Swords could be a, you could be dealing with another uh, Earth sign, Taurus, Capricorn, or Virgo. Or you could be dealing with an Air sign. What is that? Aquarius, Gemini, or a Libra. Okay. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. We got the world card in reverse. You might have tried to leave this person or try to break up with this person, but you you guys keep coming back together. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Nothing is coming full circle. And upright, this is full circle, but it's in reverse. Okay. Something is not ending here. Okay. <laughs> Virgo, you've been trying to cut it off with somebody that just won't go nowhere, huh? Okay, yeah. Tower in first position. Mm, looks like you've been trying to hit a lot of people with some towers, okay? Yeah, you might have been trying to cut a lot of people out your life, uh, Virgo, with this tower energy, okay? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. This is all of a sudden abrupt energy, okay? Mm -hmm. Unforeseen changes, okay? Yeah, you may have been trying to surprise people with, with goodbye, or you may have been shocking people with goodbye, okay? Unexpectedly, too, out of the blue. You just stop speaking to them. You just stop dealing with them, okay? Yeah, you don't like conflict. You don't like uh, long goodbyes. You don't like that back and forth argument. It's like if these people can't appreciate your presence you're going to make them appreciate your absence you just feel unappreciated by certain people okay this is some sort of shocking revelation to some people because you've been taking it for so long you've been tolerating it for so long or something like that okay mm -hmm, mm -hmm. yeah you're putting a lot of uh, relationships to an end okay you're putting a lot of relationships to an end no matter what kind it is, okay? Your your best buds, girlfriends, your dudes, boys that you used to hang out with or somebody you're dating, somebody you was married to or in a relationship with, a situation with or whoever, okay? Whoever is whoever needs that sudden cutoff, they're getting it, okay? Mm -hmm. And you're doing it without 
any explanation, without any rhyme or reason. All right. You're just in, you want to be by yourself. You need time to yourself or something like that. Yeah. With this Herman energy, you just need time to reflect. It looks like you're uh, reflecting on um, partnerships. Like I said, some type of partnership, relationship, situationships, whatever label that you call it. Okay, you just needed some time apart from certain people. You're tired of the fuck shit. Yeah, you're not communicating with anyone right now. Mm -mm, stand to yourself. You like you recharging your battery. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, you're very sensitive right now, uh, Virgo. If you're not around a certain element or a certain energy, you know, it's, it's very, uh, I should say, nerve wracking okay you're very sensitive right now you have to be around a certain element you have to be around a certain energy okay and these certain energies that you have been cutting off you guys are just not balanced it's very unbalanced it's triggering your anxiety it's triggering you now you know if it triggers your anxiety it has to go it's something negative about that okay because you vibe high you vibe high majority of you okay some of you do vibe low okay and those are those are the ones that still got to do their shadow work okay but most people who's been doing that shadow work doing those that self-healing working on themselves you're vibing high okay and when you go around certain energies that still trigger you okay mm -hmm, mm -hmm. you're too sensitive right now it bothers you so you you just turn into a pair of scissors and you've been cutting a lot of people off with no explanation none at all mm-hmm mm-hmm yeah, you just you just doing what's best for you, okay? You're keeping some sort of emotional distance for your own good, okay? Yeah, you're very fragile right now. That's the word I want to call it. it you, of course, you're sensitive, but you're also very fragile right now, okay? You you you, you at your you know you you just at your at your wits end, you know. Before you snap, you're just rather cut some people off okay because you've been taking 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 so much in and people been taking 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 without giving nothing okay and you're just a little sick of that you're just a little sick of that virgo yeah you're in your feels right now yeah you're definitely in your feelings right now Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. You're tired of being taken advantage of. That's it. Point blank. Period. Yeah. And you're manifesting some new energy here. Yeah. You're manifesting it. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Yeah. You feel everybody wants something from you and gives nothing. Okay. Yeah. You're manifesting change here. Recognition. Appreciation. Yeah. Like I said, your thing is, if you can't appreciate my presence, you're going to appreciate my absence. Point blank, period. Yep, this is how you feel. You're just not happy. You're not happy around any of the energy that's surrounding you right now. Mm-mm. No. Nope. Yeah. We also have the victory card. Yeah. We got You got success coming in. Yeah. You're getting the recognition that you deserve to. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You got success coming in. You got the victory coming in. This is the victory card. Okay? Yeah. Here's the thing, Virgo. People may not say so, but it's not easy living without you, okay? It's not easy living without your energy, okay? You provide a comfort that money just can't buy. You you provide some sort of solid or some sort of, uh, uh, like, I got a comfort, like a, you know, like a support system. You provide the, a support system, a comfort, uh that money can't buy they just can't live without whatever it is that you can provide for them or that you do to them you know you just exude it's easy for you whoever you are it's easy for you virgo to be some sort of uh listening ear supportive word you know comfort you know comfort uh comfort someone that's that's always you know upset or crying or disappointed but again you feel that i'm tired of always being there for someone and they're not there for me, okay? It's like when you when your back is against the wall and you got tears in your eye and your heart is doing some aching, no one gives a damn. But as soon as somebody else is feeling out of sorts or feeling some type of way, they run to you for that hill and then you're just a little tired of it. You want change and you're going to make it stop, okay? You're just tired of people, you know, be coming around draining your energy these little energy vampires sucking 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 the life out of you but when you need some life you can't get none okay yeah you're putting an end to that this is some more some sort of renewal that you're forcing yourself to go through or that you're allowing yourself to go through but you let you're allowing it to go in peace okay and this is shaking up a lot of people because you, your cutoff <laughs> your cutoff is vicious 
Okay, I'm talking to a group of people who don't who don't give a flying fig about what somebody else thinks. You have made yourself a priority. You have made yourself a priority. You know like you know like you know that you come first, that you matter, and you can't you can't keep exuding your energy on people who do not give a damn, okay? They will suck 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 you completely dry. Okay, and then when you need some rejuvenation, when you need somebody to support you, when you need somebody to be there for you, you just can't find it. Mm, 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 mm. Yeah, you're putting a stop to it. This is spiritual transformation. It's like your spirit, guys, is 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 opening your eyes to this because this is not just your doing. Okay, you got a whole support team behind you that's helping you realize this. Okay, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. yeah, this is some sort of renewal, some sort of some sort of all of a sudden change. And you might even hear that from your from your friends or your people, or your family, your loved ones. Why all of a sudden you changed like that? Why all of a sudden you cut us off? What's the matter? What did I do? They know what they did. You don't have to. You don't have to explain, and you know it. You know enough is enough, and too much is good for nothing. You know when it's time to cut off, okay, for your own sanity, for your own good, for your own peace of mind, okay? Mm -hmm. Yeah, you got the nine of pentacles. Some of you have been single for a very long time. Some of you are very single, very lonely, all by yourself. Some of you are very comfortable being by yourself, too. Especially the high, high vibrational energies. The super sensitive ones, yeah. It's going to take a special energy to come around you, all right? It's going to, be a, it's going to have to be a special energy to mesh with you, okay? Because when I say you're highly, highly sensitive, huh, baby, you feel it all, okay? Mm -hmm. You feel who's there for you. You feel who's not there for you. You feel who's trying to take advantage of you. You feel who's trying to support you. Okay. You could feel it all. Okay. And it seems like your energy is heightening right now. Perhaps possibly because we're going into the, the, uh, the golden age. Okay. Yeah. We just went through that shift. That shift is still taking place. I'm sure you guys still feel it. Okay. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You're vibrating, you're vibrating really, really high. Okay. Yeah. Try to listen to some, uh, some uh subliminal um uh subliminal um um what are they called chakra alignings okay they're just to keep your your chakra lined up okay you got the subliminal music they use the tones they use the different uh megahertz or something like that i think it's seven seven twenty eight hertz or something like that yeah, try to find something like that to kind of keep you balanced, especially in an alignment of your chakras, okay? Yeah, because you're super sensitive right now. You have to keep things balanced, okay? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Let me see if I can find what I'm talking about here. Give me a minute. Because you guys got to keep, you got to keep everything in alignment. Yeah. It's just time. Yeah, the frequency. You know what I'm talking about. Those frequencies. Those healing frequencies. I think it's uh, 432 hertz or 741 hertz. Yeah, try to use that one. That's the order. 528 hertz. They're really good. Okay. Definitely going to keep you balanced. Okay. Just definitely going to try to provide some sort of alignment for you. Okay. Because many of you are very, very highly, highly sensitive right now. Okay. Yeah, you got some kind of good energy coming to you. I mean, good news coming to you. Lord, you guys stay in good energy. Okay. This is what you fight for. This is what you demand. Okay. That high vibration. Okay. A lot of... Uh, a lot of uh, takers come around, you guys. I don't know why you guys gravitate so many people trying to take something from you. Okay? You have the page of wands. Yeah. Mm -hmm. A lot of good news is coming your way. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Some sort of surprise is coming your way. You got good news. Yeah, this could be good news about love. Okay? Yeah, somebody's really into you, Virgo. And I don't know if you feel the same. Some of you do. Some of you don't. Yeah. But I know many of you have been by yourself for far too long but you do you're going to hear something from somebody on on the uh you know, and this is going to be somebody that you're into romantically okay mm -hmm. and you got the will of fortune all right you got a lot of blessings coming your way it's like the tables have turned okay the universe is blessing you and the universe is also cleaning house for you okay you're cutting a lot of people out your life people come over your house they want something from you they, you got so much stuff in your house they feel that you got too much you don't need everything uh-huh 
Yeah, you got a lot of stuff. You got a lot of bags. Somebody got a lot of shoes, shoe collection. Mm, I see that quite often when I do a Virgo read. I don't know who got that shoe collection, but it's vicious. Okay, where you get them shoes from? Because they're not the average shoes. You must go overseas to get them. Good Lord. Anyway, somebody likes to come around your house and see what they can get from you. Keep them out. Okay, tell them to get their own shit. What's yours is yours, all right? You can give away if or, you know, share if you like. But somebody likes to take, 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 take. And you're a little sick of it. Put a stop to it. You also got the Ace of Pentacles. A lot of opportunities is coming your way. Your finances is doubling, tripling. Okay, your money is good. Okay, a lot of blessings is coming. You got the Wheel of Fortune and the Ace of Pentacles. Woo, baby. What doors is about to open up for you? What doors? And it's going to be one right after another. You got the Sun card. Okay, good, good energy is coming your way. It seems like ever since you cut off certain people, roles have been opening up for you, Virgo. But somebody is thinking about you. Somebody still wants to come in. And they want to come and tell you that they love you. They want to come and tell you, let's be together. Let's move out the country together. Let's let, let's make shit happen. Is this somebody thinks about you heavy. Okay? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Somebody likes how generous you are or somebody missed your generosity, okay? So make sure it's not somebody that's coming back to use the shit out of you, okay? Mm -hmm. Yeah, hopefully it's somebody that's coming to give you equal give and take, all right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But, but Virgo, whoever this is that you've been dating, they don't give equal give and take. All right. This is why you cut them off. OK, make sure this person who's thinking about you, who wants to come back, wants to give you the generosity. So everybody's so used to you being the giver, the giver, the giver, the giver. I know Virgos are the signs of service. OK, I know I get that. All right. But you make sure you get some of that service back in return. Stop letting these people drain the heck out of you. OK. Just take, take, take all these energy vampires. Uh -huh. It looks like I don't even have to tell you. You guys have already put a stop to that. Let's pull some clarifiers. Let's see what else we're going to get, okay? Yeah, it looks like you guys have already put a stop to that, so we don't need to worry about that. Yeah. You already said enough is enough and too much is good for enough. You're not letting it happen anymore. Nope. Mm-mm. You're done. Yeah, it's pretty much a wrap with that, okay? Your spirit guys and your dream team is just not letting these people do it anymore. It's like they're plotting or they're planning, okay? They go fuck up all their shit with the, with the, uh, with the idea that, oh, you know, I'll go back to my Virgo. I'll get it to, to from my Virgo. My Virgo will help me through, you know? They lose money. They waste money. You know, they lose opportunities. They waste opportunities. I'll just go back to my Virgo. They'll help me get it. They'll help me find my way back again, okay? We got Dark Knight of the Soul. Yeah, you had to shut it down. You had to go within, all right? Some things about you you had to refocus on, okay, Virgo? Good job, okay? Yeah, some of you are still working on you, all right? You lost yourself in somebody else. It just wasn't giving nothing in return. You're making yourself a priority, all right? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. New direction. I can't make this shit up. Come through, spirit. Yeah, you just guys, you you guys are just on a whole new different level right now, playing level right now, playing field. You're not just, you're just done. You're just tired of the, of the, you're just tired of the opportunities that, that you have, it, you know, that you were offered. Yeah, you ascending. Yeah, you're going on to something different. You want something different. Something else got to give to you, okay? But somebody is returning to you. Make sure this is not a person that's returning just to try to suck you dry for some more. Make sure that you're getting some reciprocity, equal give and take, okay? You de you deserve that. You are owed that, okay? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, guys, many of you are numb right now. You're so numb. You don't feel nothing. Somebody didn't hurt you. And that's never good for a Virgo to get numb and don't feel shit. Because they could be very cold. Very distant. <laughs> very cut off. When they get like that. They should let Virgo stay nice and calm. Nice and lovable energy. Because when they do get that numbing energy. That numb. Like they feel nothing. <laughs> Whoa. We got a third party situation. That's all I got to say. Somebody was trying to play you and somebody else. You cut them off, now they're full of regret. Okay? All right? Yeah. This, this was some sort of destruction you hit them with when you hit them with that tower. Their whole world fell apart when you, wasn't, when you were no longer there. Okay? When you were no longer there. You know, biting your tongue, feeling some kind of way, stomach hurting, but you don't say nothing. You just kept tolerating shit, kept tolerating shit. Don't do that to yourself, Virgo. 
Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Don't stay in that stuck energy, that confusing energy. Don't do that to yourself. Let's see what we got here. Okay. Let's see what we got here. All right, we got signs. This fell. Pay attention to the signs, okay? Pay attention to the signs, okay, Virgo? You guys don't miss no signs. You pay attention to everything. Mm -hmm. A butterfly can fly across your windshield while you're driving. You pay attention to everything. A ladybug can land on your shoulder. You pay attention to everything. You be looking shit up. What do that mean? <laughs> what that butterfly mean? What that ladybug mean? Somebody recognize you, though, uh, Virgo. They recognize who you are. They recognize you because you left. Because you're no longer around. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yep, somebody's about to take action on you, though. Mm. Somebody wants you back. Somebody wants to give you equal give and take. Mm -hmm. Somebody wants reciprocity with you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Somebody wants to be generous to you. They're going to have to be if they're going to get back into your energy. Because you're just tired of being taken advantage of. Mm -hmm. People taking your kindness for a weakness and shit like that, okay? And then you keep forgiving the same person. Who's this person? You keep forgiving. You keep forgiving the same person over and over and over and over and over again. All right. Mm -hmm. You may have old money. You might be a very wealthy energy. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Some of you just bought a house or you have your own house. Okay. You was about to give a key to somebody. All right. Mm-hmm. We have the tables have turned, all right? Honey, the tables have turned. You're going to pull your key right back. You ain't letting nobody come in that new house you just got. We got closed on your dream house, too. This is your dream house that you live in. You want to share it with this person. You just want to give them a key, all right? Mm -hmm. You got a raise, all right? Your money's increasing. We got old money. Yeah, some of you do very well financially. You ain't hurting with money, that's for sure. Yup, keys. You're definitely going to be getting some sort of house or you're moving in with somebody. Okay, well, somebody wants to move in with you, okay? Some of you are dating Aquarius, okay? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Well, some of you got an Aquarius lover that you're going through this with. Mm-hmm, yep. Virgo and Aquarius, there you go. All right, if you're dating Aquarius, this message is definitely for you. I don't want you back. <laughs> Virgo, you might have cut off an Aquarius that was very insensitive, very distant, very cold. They took, 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 and gave nothing in return. Well, this is their energy now. What have I done? Lord, have mercy. Right on top of that destruction. That's what you done. You done, dest you done destroyed something here. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. They done destroyed something with you. And full of regret. Some of you are definitely dealing with a Libra as well. Okay. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Hey, gorgeous. This Libra finds you gorgeous. They think you're very beautiful. Okay. This Libra thinks about you quite often. Mm-hmm. But they don't make too many moves with you either. Okay. Nah. They're full of regret, too. They regret everything. Yeah, you have two two air signs that you was dealing with that just wasn't investing enough. Okay? Yeah. They might have came around sometime for the get down. But nothing stable, nothing steady or something like that. Only for what you can do for them or something like that. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme give type energy. Mm -hmm. You're too kind. You're too nice, Virgo. And you know it. You're going to put a stop to it. You're tired of being used because you're tired of feeling empty afterwards. You're tired of feeling like I'm just not getting what I want. Uh-huh. 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 Seeking advice, help from friends, family, wanting to ask for help, holding back. Okay? Yeah, you're somebody's uh, support team here. Okay? You, you some, Somebody always run to you for help, advice, assistance, guidance, or something like that. Okay, you're just a little sick of it, okay? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yeah, baby, you done blocked them. No access. You said, uh-uh. You said, I'm always there for everybody, and nobody's there for me. Mm-mm. Nope, they don't respect you. It's like the more you do for them, they take advantage of it. They think you're some sort of sucker or you're 
some sort of nut or something like that. They may laugh at you for being nice to them or being kind to them or something like that. They don't see it as, you know, a gift. They see it as weakness, okay? We have fear, negative thoughts, feeling stuck and alone. That might be how you feel. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So you cut a lot of energy off. Yeah, you're just doing you right now. Well, we got stressed in reverse, so you're no longer stressed. This is why you cut people off. Uh huh. This is why you cut people off. You don't like that stress feeling. And you damn sure don't like that fucked over feeling, that's for sure. You love tarot. You might be tarot reader yourself, okay? You might be a very good tarot reader yourself. Some of you love to travel, all right? I've been thinking about going over some water or something like that. Vacation, short trip, distance traveling, road trip. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, some of you have been splurging, doing a lot of shopping lately. Okay, spending extra money, you know, just to make yourself feel better or something like that. There's a lot of rumors and whispers going on around you. Okay. Mm hmm. Very well. We also have obsession. Make sure it's. You know who this person is that's obsessed over you or something like that, okay? Mm-hmm. Yeah, this person might have you in some sort of competition, this person that's obsessed with you, okay? Be very mindful of that, all right? Be cautious of that. Yeah, somebody wants to be you or think they better than you or something like that. Uh-huh. They're watching, all right? And I don't care. This could be same sex. This could be the opposite sex. A hater is a hater, okay? Be mindful of that, all right? Spirit, come through. Can I have some more messages, please? All right, you might have a day. Spirit, come through. Can I have some messages, please, for Virgo? Can I have some more messages for Virgo? Virgo, your cards is popping out tonight. What the... Conflict. Yeah, you're sick of the argument. You've been arguing with people. You've been arguing with one particular person who who's mad at you for changing. They mad at you for changing up on them. You were supposed to keep tolerating their fuck shit. They made you angry. This is somebody who pissed you off. Okay. They made you angry. You feel you? Do you must be out your damn mind? Okay. You might see some sort of jealousy in this person, some sort of envy in this person. Okay. Yeah, this is a taker and never a giver, okay? Mm -hmm. We got a spiritual connection here, twin flame, soulmate, life partner. This is somebody that you've been dealing with for a long time. Mm -hmm. You got that connection with them, honey. <sighs> we got in denial. Somebody's in denial here, you or this person. Somebody's not seeing it for what it is. Uh -huh. Yep, we got reconciliation. This person wants to come back to you in the worst way. They want you to take them off their block list. All right. Yeah, they want you to take them off their block list. You guys got to watch it. You got a lot of jealousy, Virgo. This always comes out. Watch yourself, okay? Evil eye energy. Very manipulating energy. Somebody wants to manipulate you. Somebody has been manipulating you, and you put a stop to it, and now they pissed at you. Now they mad. Why don't you keep letting me take advantage of you? Like I've been doing for years. <sighs> You're going to have something to celebrate. Something to celebrate is coming in for you. All right. Yeah, you're doing really good by yourself. You like your peace and quiet or something like that, okay? We got change, moving, moving out, not happy in the current living circumstances. You're definitely changing something. If you're not changing your address, you're changing this energy. That's for sure. You're not putting up with something. Enough is enough and too much is good for nothing. You're just done. Who you had a fight with? You was fighting with somebody? Fighting for a chance, not backing down, defending yourself. Okay, yeah, you might have been... Defending yourself against some kind of negative energy. Yeah, some kind of jealous-ass energy. Toxic energy. Spirit guys, angels, ancestors, past loved ones. Yeah, you right, they riding with you. Your uh, angels is with you for sure, okay? Mm -hmm. This is the T, sis. All right? This is the T. This is the energy that's coming out for, for you. What's that bottom message say? Let me see. 
It says, gossip, spilling confessions, knowing more than than is being said. Okay? Mm -hmm. Yeah, somebody knows more than what they're telling you or what's being said or something like that. Keeping a secret from you or some fuck shit like that. But you already know it. You know that they totally taking advantage of you or something like that. Taking advantage of your kindness. And you're just a little sick of it. Mm -hmm. You said enough is enough. Spirit come through. What the time look like? Oh, God. 30 minutes go fast. All right. One more deck and we'll be out. Spirit come through. going to have some more messages, please. For Virgo. What's going on with Virgo? Why is Virgo cutting everybody off? Okay. Oh, you're going through that awakening. That's why. You say, oh, honey, you seeing Claire. You see how one of her eyes is black and the other one ain't? Honey, you seeing differently here. Okay? Third eye is awakened here. All right? Spirit is telling you who to keep around you and who to cut off. Uh-huh. You said it ain't me, honey. You said it's the most high working through me. You said, uh-uh. It's my dream team warning me who to cut off and who to keep around. Because they are. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You got somebody that's trying to reach you. Yeah. But you got them blocked. You got them blocked. They feel stupid now. They feel stupid because they know exactly why you got them blocked. They know. Yeah. Spirit heard conversations you didn't hear. Spirit saw things you didn't see. So this is why you got the intuitive nudge to cut them the hell off. Okay? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we got to track love with some rose quartz. Some of you need to put some in your pocket, put some in your car, put some in your pocketbook, put some on you, okay? Put your little bracelet or something, a necklace, a ring, all right? Some of you are dealing for Scorpio. Might have cut that Scorpio off. We had to, you was told to, okay? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Block calls, yeah. You've been blocking a lot of people. <laughs> You've been blocking a lot of people off because you have learned to love yourself. You have learned to cut off any and everything that's no longer serving you. Kudos to you, Virgo, for doing what's best for you. Okay? Yeah. Ooh, but you got somebody that's planning on moving in. <sighs> Some of you are moving. And it looks like you're moving in with somebody else. Okay? Uh, not necessarily. You could just be moving in. It could be just moving. But, but we got moving in. We don't have moving. All right? That could go both ways. You could be taking somebody with you or you could just be moving, okay? Yeah, this is going to be a gift from the ancestors. You know, this wherever you're about to go next, okay? Whatever it is that you're about to do. Oh, some of you have been burning your joss paper. This is why your ancestors is writing with you so hard, okay? You done reached out to them. And you know, once you reach out to them, honey, they don't stop coming, okay? Oh, honey, they say you talk too much. Virgo, they say you're telling too much of your business. Keep quiet. They say you're talking too much. Keep your mouth shut. All right? Walk in silence. Everything ain't for everybody. Stop sharing what you know. Let them do some research and find out they got themselves. Okay? Some of you have a green thumb. All right, Virgos, you got to surround yourself with plants, okay? You should find a green room like this and put one in your house like this. It charges your batteries, okay? I hope you enjoyed my reading. I certainly enjoyed bringing it to you. If you like my video, give me a thumbs up. Leave me a comment. Talk to you soon. I should.